there, it was music that had stories behind them. And Vivaldi's Four Seasons, they're such a unique set of concertos, partly because the, the music itself is so wonderful, but also because Vivaldi himself wrote the sonnets upon which he based the, these four violin concertos. And I'm going to be playing you bits of the music just to um, demonstrate how Vivaldi was so creative using musical imagery and what I took from that musical imagery and incorporated it into the, the story. But first let me read you the sonnet um, that um, Vivaldi used for the concerto Winter. Um, and that's, that's playing with fire takes place in the dead of Berkshire winter uh, between Christmas and New Year's. So actually, come to think of it, it would make a terrific Christmas present. <laughs> get, you can get your shopping done right away. Not, nothing to worry about. No Black Friday. OK, so this is what Vivaldi wrote. Shivering and frozen mid the frosty snow in biting, stinging winds, running to and fro, stamping icy feet, teeth chattering in the bitter chill. That's the part of the sonnet for the first movement. The second movement is resting contentedly beside the hearth whilst those outside are drenched by pouring rain. And the final movement. We tread the icy path with greatest care for fear of slipping and sliding. With a reckless turn, we fell crashing to the ground and rising hasten across the ice, lest it should crack. We feel the chill north winds course through the home despite the locked and bolted doors. This is winter, but still what joy it brings. So I'm gonna play you a little bit from Winter um, and tell you a little bit about what Vivaldi was trying to come across with. So of course this is a, a concerto for violin and orchestra and um, you just have to imagine the orchestra doing doing some things along with me. But it starts out with uh, people shivering, and what Vivaldi does is, is have this special effect here. So they're outside on the ice, shivering, and then the horrid, stinging north wind comes. escape the winds, uh, they're running to and fro on the ice, and they're stamping their feet to keep warm. So you'll hear the foot stomping.